Welcome. Today I would like to talk to you about how to search in our library catalog or what we sometimes call the EDS. One of the things that's always great to know is this is just one section of the material you have access to, but it is a great resource to have. Looking in here, we're going to search for some articles, we're going to take a look at books and we can see what else we're going to find. Today I want to talk about otters and I want to talk about their tool use. Right off the bat, I just want to show you a few fabulous things. One of the things that you're going to find out is over here, we could refine our search. Maybe we only wanted to know about sea otters, and we could add that into our search over here. The second thing we can take a look at is sometimes we can limit. If we say we only want full text, that means that all of the articles need to be the PDFs attached. However, that's going to leave off a bunch of information that we could find out. These little get it links will take us into all of the different material that we want to read about. We also can take a look down here at our resource type. What our resource type is going to tell us is whether or not it's an academic journal, which we have 23 articles right here whether or not it's a magazine. So this could be something such as popular science, or it could be nature or even National Geographic, or maybe we wanna take a look at a couple of books. Today, I'm gonna to take a look at a couple of the books to start off. Right off the bat, we have this one, orangutan hats and other tool uses. If I click on the link, it will tell me more about the book. If I wanna check this book out, I'm going to look at the location, which tells me it's at the Rutherford Library. It's going to give me the call number, and then it's just going to tell me the section that it is in. So if I want to take a look at this material, I could go over to the Rutherford and look it up by its call number, or I could click place a hold and log in with my CCID and password. And I could place a hold on the material where some delightful individual will go grab it off the shelf put it onto one of the hold shelves that are located on the first floor of the different libraries you have access to, and then you'll get an email when your material is ready to be picked up. However, maybe I also only wanted to take a look at my materials that were journals. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go back to my search over here. Oh, we can always start it again as well. And we're gonna again, take a look in here for otters and tool use. Click on my search. And now I'm gonna come down and I wanna take a look only at the academic journals. So it's gonna update. And now either I can click on the article right here and it's gonna give me the information I need to see. So it's gonna tell me what the article was about. It's gonna tell me my subject terms. It's gonna tell me the journal that this article is from. And if I want access to this journal, I can either click the URL down here or I can click the Get It at UAlberta. Clicking on either of these links will take me straight into the article, which is an amazing experience. If I can't find anything when I'm searching and I'm not too sure how everything is working, what I want you to remember is we have this incredible chat with us service right over here on the library website. What you can do is at any time and any type of question, just give a chat and we will either help you through the service or we will connect you to the individuals that you need to connect with to be able to get your research and all of the information that you need. Thank you.